In January 2023, a controversial left-wing politician, Sarah Wagenknecht, and a well-known second-wave feminist, Ali Schwarzer, wrote something called The Manifest for Peace. And later, in interviews on political talk shows in Germany, there was an alarming both-sidedism, and there was also a downplaying of the rape of Ukrainian women. Let's talk with Ursula, who followed these developments closely, to help us understand what's going on in Germany. Let's start with who Sarah Wagenknecht is and how relevant she is to Germany's policy towards Ukraine. Yeah, well, actually, I would say she's not really that relevant to German policy towards Ukraine at all, um, at least not the official German foreign policy towards Ukraine. Let's talk about who she is. Well, she's an icon of the far left in Germany. If you notice her appearance, she's, she even dresses like Rosa Luxemburg. Right. So she's a well-known figure, but she's also a controversial one, uh, also within the left. I mean, um, she grew up in the GDR um, and she's a very famous um, like member of what was called the communist platform within the left party. So that's like the part of the German left party that's very far left and they advance like this kind of orthodox Marxist ideology. One, just one anecdote that says it all. Is if you ask her what she did when the Berlin Wall came down, she always tells the story that she retreated to her study to read Hegel, right? <laughs> Which is unbelievably pretentious, but also it tells you a lot about her ideology, right? That she was... Well, a socialist and also someone who was feeling quite comfortable in the GDR. Um, so when the Berlin Wall came down and the GDR ceased to exist for that, for her, it was the end of the world, basically. <laughs> a little bit. So, yeah, she's one of the main figures in the far German left. But she's not at all representing a, a, a majority in the German public at all. Want to know more about what's shaping German foreign policy towards Ukraine? Watch the whole interview with Ursula Stark and subscribe to my YouTube channel.